All right, back to our weather now. Vanessa Murdoch is here once again with her complete first alert forecast. A brutally cold last couple of days, yeah. but if you like warm weather, like everyone knows, I, <laughs> yes. I do, uh, we're in for a treat. Yeah, a true treat this week. We do have some opportunities for rain, but compared to the temperatures that we will get to enjoy, you don't have to worry about the rain. It's just some opportunities for wet weather, but no day looks like a washout. And we're talking about spring like warmth rolling into town tomorrow. Let's give you a look live outside. It is pleasant but cold. Skies are cloudy still. It's 32 degrees. Feel like 26. As we look at your headlines overnight, skies will clear, temperatures stay cold. Then we have that big warm up starting tomorrow and a few chances for wet weather as we roll through the week. This afternoon, highs were well below seasonable. We should be topping out at 49 degrees right now. It was 20 degrees below that in Monticello today with a high of 29, 32 in Trenton, 35 was the high in Islip this afternoon. But we will make the climb quite quickly. Tomorrow, 55, Tuesday, 63. And on Wednesday, it's a high of 60. But this is not the warmest it will be. We expect to push 70 as we roll into the work week's end. As far as the setup, we did see a snow shower roll through earlier tonight. That was a result of this warm front lifting through. Now high pressure takes control of your forecast, allows winds to bring warm air in out of the southwest, and that will help to warm us up tomorrow. We will also enjoy a lot of sunshine. Then we're tracking this area of low pressure, which gets close enough to us to Tuesday to maybe throw a few showers in our direction, but that's it. It was looking like just a few showers, mainly north of the city Tuesday. As far as what we can enjoy is really a lot of unseasonable warmth moving forward. So right now we're stuck in the cold, but we're tapping into this mild air in the midsection of the country starting tomorrow, and we will continue to do that over the next several days. As far as what you can expect overhead tonight, skies will be clearing. We're going to start your Monday off bright and beautifully. A few more clouds as we roll into the afternoon, but generally speaking, just a gorgeous way to kick off your work week. We're going to hit 55 tomorrow under mostly sunny skies. Winds will be out of the west southwest at 5 to 10, ushering in that warmer air, but it will be cooler along the south shore where those winds are rolling in over the open waters. 51 for a high tomorrow in Shirley. We'll top out at 58 in Toms River, 55 in Andover, and 53 for a high in Woodbury. Seven days until spring, the first day of spring, looking cooler than much of the rest of the week. Here we go. 63 on Tuesday. That slim chance of a shower as we make our way into Wednesday. 60 with a mix of sun and clouds. On Thursday, St. Patrick's Day, 59 degrees. Possibility of some wet weather, mainly south. Friday, 68. We could certainly see some 70s out there with a late chance. Soggy Saturday and then spring rolls in Sunday at 58. It's about time spring made its day. <laughs> I, I know. I think we're, we're ready. Yes, we are. Thanks so much, Vanessa.